John Ason at 3D Golf Performance, and um, just talking a little bit about misconceptions and some common ones um, out there, and maybe one of the most common ones that caused a lot of uh, poor mechanics in the golf swing is your understanding of what part of the ball do you hit to make it A, go forward, and B, go up. And we hear a lot in our um, lessons that golfers are trying to get under the ball. That's maybe the most popular one because you're trying to make the ball go up in the air. Well, our job as golfers is actually to hit the ball forward and let the loft of the golf club lift the ball. So you must understand that the center of the ball, or the equator of the ball, is the part of the ball you're aiming at to hit with the club face somewhere around that fourth or fifth groove. Let the club face then, therefore, propel the ball up. So that gives you the backspin and the lift. More specifically, when you're actually aiming at what part of the ball do you hit and it's on the ground, you like to use this little drill here where I've got three balls lined up on a diagonal and my aiming point is actually going to be the inside center of the ball where I have my stick lined up there. So you can see that the path of that stick is slightly from the inside going out towards one o'clock as opposed to my square alignments in my setup sticks here. So as I set up to the ball, my eyes are on that inside quadrant and that's where I want to hit it. I want to be on that path. I want to hit it with the face angle slightly open. So I'll draw this stick back and I'll leave it there as a reminder. And I'm going to use our launch monitors in the simulator system here. And I'm going to try to hit that inside quadrant. I think I did it. Went up the right hand side and I can see the ball fly. And we'll just check our, uh, our screen here. You can see the swing analysis sheet that comes up. And uh, once again, I'm looking at these numbers down here. You can see the red line is definitely on that same angle going towards 1 o'clock. And it reads inside out 8.5 degrees. And my face was about 4 degrees open. So this calculation allows me to hit a relatively straight shot because the face was open four degrees to an eight degree inside out path. So they're kind of half. So that's what I'm looking for because that'll start the ball to the right and curve it back and give me that nice draw pattern. So misunderstanding what part of the ball do you hit? Not the south pole, the back of the ball, the equator, and the inside quadrant. Focus your eyes on that by putting three balls together like this on a diagonal. If you have your sticks set up, this is the way you want to set up your sticks, and then you're going to get terrific feedback on exactly what your path and your face are doing while you're practicing this. Enjoy the hit, and good golfing.